Hello everybody, good afternoon. It's me, Mamta Rana, your basic level math teacher of Nobel Environment Academy. Hello students, how are you? Hope you are all fine. And today we are going to read uh, Unit 1 Algebra. Yes? And here, Order Pair. This is for Class 6 and the subject is Optional Math. Okay? In class 6, we have to read optional math. Yes, in unit 1, there is given algebra. Yes, we are going to read about algebra in unit 1. And uh, now, today's topic is about order pair. Okay? And we do about order and pair also. Yes? This word order and pair, this is not new for us. Yes? Order mean specified order. Yes, and pair mean two. Yes, and the order pair mean collection of object. Yes, in pair. The collection of object in pair is order pair. And that collection that should be specified. Okay, the collection that should be specified. And I have written here some order pairs you can see here Nepal, Kathmandu, China, Beijing, Sri Lanka and Colombo yes here any pair yes one component is the country's name and another component is what it's capital capital city yes here China country's name and Beijing is capital city. Sri Lanka country and its capital city. Sri Lanka country and its capital city is Colombo. It means order pair means we have to write the collection in order. Okay? And in order pair, the components or the elements that should be separated by comma and enclosed by round bracket or small bracket. Okay? X and Y. This is also the example of order pair. 1, comma 2. This is also the example of order pair. Likewise, Nepal, comma, Kathmandu. This is also example of order pair. Okay? In order pair, we have to use round bracket okay and we should separate the component by comma okay and this is called first component or first element and y is second element okay this is first element yes this is Second element. Okay? And its another name is Yes. This first letter, yes, they are called first element. X coordinate, yes, its name is first element. We can say it for first element, X coordinate also, and this. Second element, second letter. It is called second element or Y coordinate also. Yes, its name. And another name is its first element of order pair. It is called abscissa also. Okay? Abscissa. Yes. It is called abscissa also. Okay? And second element is named ordinate. Yes. First element of order pair, they are they have various names. Yes, it is called first element also, X coordinate and abscissa. Okay? And second letter, second letter of order pair, they are called Second elements also, y coordinate and ordinate also. 
your snail. Okay? Okay. Then you don't confuse if they said ordinate. Yes, ordinate means the second letter of the order pair. If there is, you see the axisa. Axisa means the first letter of the order pair. Yes and Y. Yes. This X, Y, this is the order pair. Okay? And here we use the notation of order pair. Here we use in the middle of the elements of order pair. We use here comma and we give the round bracket. Okay? We close the elements of order pair by round bracket. Okay? Pen, comma, pencil. This is also the one example of order pair. Okay? Look, here we use comma. Yes, to separate the first element and the second element or axis or ordinate. Yes, we uh, x coordinate or y coordinate and we use the round bracket to close it. Okay? 2, comma, 4. Here, this is also the example of order pair. Okay? Here, the numbers, it is in the pair. So, it is the order pair. And here, we use comma and round brackets. Okay? And 2 is called x coordinate or axis. This 4 is called y coordinate or ordinate. Okay? If you write like this, curly bracket 2 dot 4. Is it order pair? No, this is not order pair. Yes, students? 2 dot 4. This is not the example of order pair. Why? Here, here is given point to separate the letter 2 and 4. Yes? And here, we are using the curly brackets to enclose the elements. So, they are not, this is not the example of order pair. Okay? Yes. I think you are clear about order pair. Okay. Again, Apple, apple, comma, mango, curly brackets. Sorry, small bracket. Yes, this is the example of order pair. Yes, first component, first component of this order pair is apple, and the second component of this order pair is mango, and they are separated by comma, and they are closed by small brackets. Yes, this is, this is the correct example of order pair. And now we are going to read next topic, equality of order pair. Yes, equality of order pair. Equality, yes? The word equality says what? Yes, all we are known about is equality. Equality means equal. Yes, equal order peer. Yes, if, if the corresponding components of two order peer are same, then they are called the equality order peer. Yes, they, we can say the two order pair are equal. Okay? 2 comma 3 2 comma 3. Yes. These two order pair are equal. Yes. First component of this order pair 2. Second components of order pair also 2. Yes. Sorry. First component. First and first component are equal. And second and second components also Equal. So they are equal order pair. Okay students? To be a equal order pair, 
equal. Okay? And if I write here 1 comma 2, 1 order pair and 2 comma 1, next order pair. Let's see its corresponding components are equal or not. Okay. First, first component of this order pair is 1 and the first component of this order pair is 2. It means these two axes are, axes are, they are not equal. Yes? So, this is not equal order pair. Yes? These two order pair are not equal. Okay? If in axis there is apple and ordinate, there is mango and to be are equal, we need here in axis apple. Yes, student? Yes, apple and in ordinate, we need mango. Then only we can say these two order pair are equal. Okay? If if here in place of mango there is papaya. Yes? Axis are axis are equal. Apple apple, second component. Yes, ordinate. There here is papaya and here is mango. They are not equal. So this is not equal order pair. Understand? Okay. Yes, we completed our equality of order pair. Okay, and one thing. If, if x comma y, this order pair is equal to 2 comma 3. Then, what should be here? Then, yes, if x comma y, yes, this order pair is equal to 2 comma 3. Then what is the value of x and what will be the value of y? Can you tell me? Here x is size x and here x is size 2. It means that x and 2 should be equal. Yes. These two order pair are equal. It says that x is of x is size. X is of these two order pair must be Equal. So, x equals to 2. And the ordinate. Ordinate of these two order pair must be equal. Because these two order pair are equal. So, y is equals to 3. Yes? If two, two order pair, if two order pairs are equal, yes, with the help of equality of order pair, we can find out the unknown value. Okay, here x and y, they are unknown. Yes, with the help of these two order pairs are equal. So, from here we can find out the value of x, that is 2, and the value of y, that is 3. Understand? Like this way, we can do our exercise. Yes, in your exercise, there is given more questions. Okay, you just try it. If you have any confusion, then you can ask me. Okay, students. Yes. Optional awesome math, this is new for you. Yes. So just you try it and order pair. The first topic, there is even order pair. This is not hard. This is very much easy. And in exercise, there is also easy questions are given but also if you have any confusion then you can ask me through our messenger okay so question number one in question number one you have to find out that order pair are equal or not okay and question number two there is given two order pair are equal here already the question told these two order pair are equal with the hand of that you have to find out the value. Okay. In number A, that is same like a same like I have just drawn. So question number two, your exercise 1.1. Question number two, number B. I want to do here A comma 
b cross 2 is equals to 3 comma 4 this is the question okay find the value of unknown variable from the following equal order pure this is your question you have to find out the value of unknown variable yes from the equal order pair here it is given the order pair are equal this first order pair and this second order pair they are equal and we know if two order pair are equal then their first component and second component first component to first component must be equal yes second component and second component must be equal yes yes the property of equality of order pair told us yes that if two order pairs are equal then its abscissa abscissa are equal ordinate ordinate are equal yes yeah? so yes here yeah? a is equal to 3 yes a is equal to 3 we find out the value unknown value of a that is 3 okay and b plus 2 equals to 4 yes here in the first order pair the second component or ordinate that is b plus 2 and the in second order pair the ordinate or the second component that is 4 and it is said that these two order pair are equal then that two ordinate must be equal yes 4 cross 2 is equal to so b cross 2 is equal to 4 and how much to be b yes here b equals solve the equation we already did solving equation in class 5 yes b equal 4 minus 2 or b equals 2 yes okay this is equation solving we read already in class 5 okay now therefore value of value of a equals 3 and value of b equals Okay, student. Okay, you completed. There is given only one, two, three questions. Yes. If you have any confusion, then you can ask me. Okay, we completed our this topic, and in next class we read about Cartesian product. Okay. Thank you, class. Okay.